Hey there, my crushers. It's Lisa coming at you again here in the studio with another look on our hair hat journey, our crush hair hat journey, where I'm taking you from um, hairstyles and looks from wash to wash and all the styles in between with my hair and how I'm wearing crush hats and crush caps. Uh, with those looks. So let's get into it with this one today. This is number 10 on our journey. This is the Bonnie Cloche Crush Hat. Yes, I said a cloche. So you know that my style is uh, definitely steeped in a little bit of vintage inspiration, which is why I wore this black and white today because <clears throat> it feels like um, it's, it's a little retro, it has a retro feel to it. So I wanted to show you how you can wear this Bonnie Cloche Crush, which is a, 20 a 20s inspired hat and today. So here we have it, the Bonnie Cloche Crush. Again, they come size, small, medium, large, extra large. I skipped large, didn't I? Small, medium, large, extra large, extra, extra large. You know I customize them. I make them so I can customize it to your head size. But um, they also have the adjusters on the inside with the sweatband so that you can pull and tie and customize it for your own fit. Okay, so once you get the size that you know you fall in, you can always size it up a little bit or size it down a little bit based on what you need okay so now the crush and my hair so my hair has gotten bigger because uh, with time she definitely uh, starts to get more uh, fuller more full and a little bit shorter because if you know uh, natural hair <laughs> once it's stretched and it goes in and it goes in and it goes in <laughs> So, as it goes in, it fills in more and it gets a little bit thicker. So, um, you'll see that as we go. Uh, if you look at the other uh, videos on the channel, you'll see uh, the evolution of what my hair does. So, um, and this is a twisted, a, a, a twisted look that um, it's called a twist out. And I just like... Um, it's twisted at night and then uh, two strand twisted and bantu knots and then I undo it uh, in the day. If I want to wear my hair out, I'll do it. So, all right, that's it for the hair. Now for the hat. The Bonnie Cloche Crush, here we go. And you can see that it has a taller crown and the stingy brim going around. So you will see how that is going to work today. All right, here's the Bonnie Cloche Crush. I'm just going to put it on right and you know I wear a size large right so this has a little bit of a brim so you can see there it's not very much of a brim and then you've got all of this to play with no problem just like with the crush you want to start here toward the bottom right you want to grab some and you want to fold and fold. I fold from front to back with this one because you get a design in the back as well. <laughs> That's kind of fun. That has kind of a, a 30s feel to it. They used to do really funny hats in the 30s with um, very interesting shapes uh, and a, as well as uh, it was kind of going from the 20s into the 30s. So um, the brims got a little bit bigger. I'm just going to flip her to the side a little bit, right? Okay. That is the Bonnie. And I'm just going to stuff that little point in. If you don't want it, it's all right. She won't be mad. She'll just go in there. She'll come back out when you want her to. Okay. So this is the Bonnie, right? Isn't that fun? Now, you know, with my hats, I designed them so that you can get automatic raking over that eye. Again, whichever eye is your best eye, whichever side you want to profile, that's the one that you expose, right? Just going to take my hair back a little bit so you can see how it would look 
if you had your hair off of the face. And you can also see that if you bring it down in the back, you will get a different look. See that? Now that really looks like a, a close, right? And at the top, you can do all types of fun things with the extra fabric that is in the crown. Again, you're folding, folding, folding. And you can always get rid of the point. The point is fun though, I think. I think she's kind of fun. She's a surprise, you know? <laughs> and with this hat, which is also fun, you could just let it relax to the back if you wanted to and hide your point. Just like a little envelope, just hide it in the back there. Let's see if you can see it. Is my hand's in there. I hope you can see that. If you don't want to have all the extra folds in the top, you can let it relax to the back and then just make the excess disappear by folding. Again, you've got that 20s feel. When you bring it down in the back, you really get that 20s cloche feel with the hat. See that? And of course, you could bring it up in the back. Look at that, I just pulled it up in the back. And I get a totally different look, right? This is my hair in here. Now, if you have, if you're wearing a low to no style, right, where you don't have fullness built into the hat, you would be able to fold it down even more and make it as flat as you want. Or, you know, our other trick is to fill it, fill it up even more. Now, my hair is making it do, let's see now. It's just so, there's so much fun because you can do so many different things with the crushes. My hair is right in here, filling this up. <laughs> so why don't I do this? Why don't I flatten my hair out? Let's see if I could do that. Ooh, where's my part? Okay, I'm gonna flatten my hair out a little bit here. And then you'll see. Okay, so let's see what happens now that I've flattened it out a little bit. Okay, so this is my head here now, right? We'll take it down in the back for that 20s look. And I have this, all of this to play with. So, without the excess hair in there, I'm able to bring it on down. Do you see those folds? and get it very close. So I could either let it just, everything collapse to the back and then just tuck, tuck, tuck to get it flat. Or I could work it from the bottom up, folding, folding, folding. And then I just tucked my little, my little point. <laughs> I just tucked her away. <laughs> but you can do whatever you want because you're styling it yourself every time. So I want to thank you so much for joining me today. This is look 10. This is the Bonnie Cloche Crush hat. And um, I think I'll come back and I'll show you what she looks like when she's full. I think I will try that. I'll do that. Yeah, I will. I'll see you next time here in the studio. Stay safe in style. And uh, be sure to subscribe and check out the other uh, tips and tricks on the channel. Thanks so much, and I'll see you next time. Bye!